Okay, a bus is 45 feet long at rest. If it's going by at 0.45, ooh, 45 danger. Uh, what is its length as we observe? Well, it's going to shrink, right? The bus is going to shrink in the direction it's moving, not its height, but its width, right? Okay, so what is its length? So its length is going to be, uh, length is going to be the original length times the square root of 1 minus b squared over c squared, right? So it's going to be, um, 45 square root of 1 minus 0.45c squared over c squared. Okay, so 45 times the square root of 1 minus 0.45 squared. It's going to be 40.2 meters long, basically. Or 40.2 feet, sorry because these were feet to begin with, right? Okay, what is its length as observed by the people on the bus? Well, that's how long it is at rest, and the people who are on the bus are not moving with respect to the bus. So the people see, the people on the bus still see 45 feet, okay? Because if they saw the bus shrinking, if they could see that, then they would know they were moving and the earth was sitting still, but there's no way to do that. It's all relative, right? There's no way to, there's no experiment you can do to determine whether you're moving and the ground is sitting still or the ground is sitting still and you're moving, okay? Let's see, if the bus goes through a tunnel that has a proper length of 45 feet, what length do the people in the bus observe it to be? Well, <laughs> the tunnel is 45 feet long, right? But the tunnel is moving past them at the same speed, right? And so the people are going to see, they're going to see the tunnel as exactly the same length, right? They're going to see that 45 meter or 45 foot long tunnel, right? But its length will be contracted because the tunnel is moving with respect to them. So they're going to see, they're going to see it as 40.2 feet, right? Okay. Um, why is there not a single answer to does the bus fit inside the tunnel? Um, okay, okay. So if you're on the bus, you're going to see the tunnel as only 40.2 feet long. And the bus you're going to see is 45 feet long. So the bus does not fit inside the tunnel. The people on the bus see this. The bus. The people on the bus see this there it is right they see this and they see the tunnel as like not long enough okay here's this tunnel okay so they, they, the bus does not fit in right uh, we see we see the tunnel of course as being 45 feet long and the bus is being only 40.2 feet right the wheels are now oval the bus looks more like a, a chevy blazer Ford Bronco from the seventies, thinking Stranger Things, right? So the, we see the we see the the, the uh, bus is forty point two feet long and the tunnel is forty five feet long. So we see it does fit inside. They see that it does not fit inside. Okay, um, so there's not. It just depends on the reference frame, right? If you're in the, uh, riding the bus, it doesn't fit, and it really doesn't fit. You could do experiments to show that it doesn't fit. Uh, if you're watching the bus go by, it does fit. It's relative. 